can't go out with him. Go sit down. Say it, okay? Or I'm going to take a sucker from you. All right. So, hi. Uh -uh. Hi, so it's me. I'm back. Um, <clears throat> I am taking donations for my lashes, okay? I have uh, made it past the infection in my eye. Okay, it's going on three weeks, and I want my lashes back, all right? Um, it costs usually about $100 um, and $10 to probably get them started. Um, I'm going to put my Cash App handle on here in case you want to be a blessing. Dollar sign, Lakeisha, capital L, A, capital K, E S H A, P, capital P. Capital R E E S E. Okay. Um, I'm so serious. But anyway, so I have been struggling on vlog and stuff. I don't know what the vlog. I don't know how to. I ain't gonna say how. I don't know what the vlog because my life is just is monotonous. It's not like it's a little bored. It's a mom life. Look at her. Ash, get down. And I have um I've missed like two weeks of posting. So my goal is is to like have a series for each month. Every. I said Sundays, but I'm going to change my post today to Monday because it's just hard to do it on Sunday because I'll be tired. So, I'm trying to talk real quick before the doctor get in here. Um, I'm going to tell y'all where we at and what's going on. So, um, another thing I struggle with is like editing um, stuff out because I have so much footage. And I just be want to post all of it, like 30 minutes worth of footage. And I don't want to be a boring YouTuber and people be like, oh my God, I don't want to watch your vlog. But you have like a million things of minutes on your vlog. But whatever, I'm going to the point now where I don't care. Um, because if you're going to watch, you're going to watch. Um, because I feel like my life is very relatable to, you know, people that are, you know, I ain't going to say older, but like I'm 41. Um, that, you know, just grown, grown people life, grown women life. You know what I'm saying? So, um... I'm just gonna run with it, you know what I'm saying? Um, Cause I wanna be consistent. I've been very inconsistent because I just been tired. I've been, I can't even say overwhelmed, I'm just tired, just tired. So I'm, um, this is my attempt at uh, just vlogging and, and being, um, just putting it out there. So, and then another thing too, I think this is like the third thing. I have not wanted to post because I'm like, I don't want folks knowing what I do every day. Uh, so they can come find me and try to sell my organs on the black market. Um, and you know, that, and the chances of that happening is probably slim to none. But the point is, is that, um, it's a kind of boring life, you know what I'm saying? And I like it, I like my life. Uh, but I'll probably post when I have stuff going on. And this is one of those things, which uh, leads me to the segue that I have about what's going on. So, um, the date should be down here somewhere. Today is January 15th, MLK Day. I am off work today, praise the Lord. The twin school is closed. Um, but Ethan started running a fever yesterday, even after church. It got like, it was the spike to like 102.1. Um, and I felt like he felt a little warm. He had been, the day before, which was Saturday, he had been sneezing. No, you gotta wait for the doctor to come in here. Give it to me so I can, we can, uh, come on. I get to get it after we leave because you don't want your tongue to be blue or green or whatever before he come in here, okay? Anyway, so Ethan is, um, like I said, yeah, what was it? He, yeah, he started running a fever yesterday, but the day before Saturday, he started sneezing just a few times, not a whole lot. And he was acting like himself, kind of. He just kind of laid around or whatever. And I was like, oh my God, he probably has an ear infection. Um, and we got tubes put in a month ago um, to help with this. And I guess my thought process on that um, is, I thought it was supposed to like stop them all together, but I guess it's supposed to minimize them. They said he got the, he needed the tubes because his uh, Eustachian tube wasn't long enough. I don't know if that was because they were preemies uh, or because, uh, I don't know. I don't know why. And they took part of his adenoids out. They were gonna take all of them out, but they said they were too big and they decided not to take them out. Um, all the way, so they took partial adenoids out. Hold on. <clears throat> The suckers in my purse. Alright, I'm down here kneeling on these people floor and I ain't got that much more in me to lean down. Nip balls. Okay. They don't nip balls. Like yeah, I, 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 I,
So anyway, so Ethan, don't be too loud, brother. Uh, so anyway, here we are. I do believe he has an ear infection. They swabbed him, I guess, for anything else that uh, is on the panel, probably RSV, strep, whatever. But he is consistent with the, excuse me, the pain in his ear. And I think it's his left ear. Um, I think he said right at one time too, but I don't know. Tuesday in both of his ears. So, uh, what else? Um, um, oh yeah, and he vomited twice. Like he did like yesterday evening and i'm pretty sure it was because his temperature was so high and i had been rotating um ibuprofen and motrin i'm saying Mo ibuprofen and tylenol and then um he did it again around three something this morning because his temperature had spiked again um and i felt so bad because i had lost track of time with you know keeping up with the rotation and stuff so his it should be like another 30 minutes before he is having another dose of pain medication fever fever reducing medication but i do believe god that that's all that's going on with him but um they're gonna do doc the doctor's gonna come in probably check his ear and stuff um to confirm that it is an ear infection when i talked to the on call nurse last night she told me that maybe it was um the pressure from the tubes that made him vomit so i'm not alarmed about the vomiting because i'm used to seeing it by now i just hate having to deal with it um so, be, 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 what's next? So, I just, you know, believe that that's what it is. Pray that, that that's what it is. A simple fix. And then, let's put your foot back on that table. Oh, my God. Then I have to go to the doctor. Hey, good morning. Are you okay? Oh. That was down here. Oh, my God. Get on. No, you can't. You have to wait until Dr. Harold is done. Oh, I like your hat. Say like, thank you. Is it, a, is it a bird? It almost looks like Poppy. Pop it's Poppy's, the, I don't Poppy know. off of the troll. Okay, I don't should put that. Oh my God. Um, Saturday, he sneezed a few times um, and had a little congestion and running nose. But that was it. But yesterday, he um, spiked a fever. The highest it got was 102.1. And then he started complaining. I asked him if he was um, hurting. And he told me, uh, I, well, I asked him where he was hurting, if anywhere. And he was like, oh, my ear hurts. And so he hadn't had an appetite. So with me poking him full of the rotational meds, yeah. that's what I'm thinking caused his, him to vomit. So he did that. Oh, how many times did he vomit? Twice. Okay. It was very spaced out. It was like yesterday evening and then this morning around 3 or so. But again, it was pretty consistent with the temp spike and the meds that I had just given him. Um, but he's been, he hadn't drank a ton of water and apple juice, but he has been sipping here and there. And just, you know, can't lay down, cranky. Yeah. I guess for the story, did he say anything about his throat hurting at all? Mm -mm. This is ear. Hey, pretty girl. Hey, Ethan. What ear hurts? Okay, okay. Is that is it right ear? Yeah. Uh huh. <clears throat> you can't put it on. All right, girl. You don't need it, but okay. Oh goodness. Mm -hmm. oh, no, that's not your Donald Duck juice. This is Ethan. What's my juice? Uh, yours is gone, sister. Oh. Just as a follow up from oh. the last time I saw him was in October. Mm -hmm. Then he got an oh, antibiotic prescribed in November. The five days Zithromax. Hush, I'm talking about. By the end of the year, that's by Doctor Newman. Yeah, he did the um, he got his tubes in December. Oh. Oh, yes. he got two. Yes, I thought they would have sent over the um, yeah, paperwork. Yeah, sometimes they do and sometimes they don't. Okay. Let me see. I might have missed it. Okay. Now that I saw the name associated with it. Oh, that's the okay. <laughs> Yeah, did they did it. Too. Yeah, it was either early or mid-December. I can't remember when. Or it might have been November. I don't know. But I know he, he's had them for at least a month. Okay. Um, And it was before Christmas when he got the tubes. So, um... 
And do you, has there been any drainage from his ears? He had a tiny, tiny bit of drainage when, like, a day or so after he had the procedure, and we okay. did use yeah. those ear drops like they suggested that we do. No current um, drainage, though. Mm -mm. He didn't even run a fever with the procedure. He bounced back, like, did, within and, hours. <laughs> yeah. And did Ashlyn ever get tubes? No. Okay. How's her, how's her tummy doing? Any, any changes? Um, it's body? better. Okay. And I've just been doing, um, giving her the medication morning okay. and night. And um, what I do is after she, don't drop that, Ethan. Or you won't have a device, brother. Um, sh uh, what I do is after she eats, I prop her up. Like if she's going to sleep or something like that. Okay. Um, just, you know, kind of doing like the preventative stuff. And yeah. it has helped. She's only vomited one time. But that was like, like I said, I think she gets confused, and she's like, I gotta, I gotta throw up, and I'm like, don't cough so hard, and she's like, <laughs> and then it'll, but it's literally just been yeah. once since we've been here. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I think that that was the it's remedy. It's better. That's awesome. I know. You get this cool pink fluorescence, and you got much socks on what yeah kind of, you got just this the, the van classic yeah van. something to throw on when you get the yeah. house <laughs> <laughs> and hey, put your shoe back on baby a little bit more you got it dude big boy there's your tube still looks open good no redness at all and then this big boy yeah, you know it looks okay i it looks like the tube's still in place mm -hmm. and it don't i don't see anything what happened? Um, he was explaining to me that the eustachian tube yes. apparently was not draining properly or long enough or something. Yes. Yes. And he said that that definitely was part, probably part of the issue yes. as to why he was having chronic ear infections. And he said that um, his adenoids too, because well, really, he said they were large. Know. Yeah, we can't see the adenoids when we're looking uh, this way. They, they have to see it when they're... They can either x-ray them or they can see it when they do the... Yeah. They've got scopes and stuff that they can see yeah. it. It's because they're, they're they're too high up behind. They're in the throat, but they're really S up the cyanotic. nose level. Yeah. The way the tonsils are here, the adenoids are too yeah. high for me to see. Almost. We've got to check your mouth again. we got to do the eye part again. I gotta, we'll do the eye part. I do a cute tip in your mouth. Let's do an eye part. Come on, let's see. Let's, but relax just a sec. Let me get it ordered. Okay, let me talk to you. You want to... Um, and then you can get your sucker and just and the stretch you. You get your sucker as soon as he gonna you you know what a Q tip look like, Ethan? Let's see. Q tip, Q tip. No. No, in your mouth. In your mouth. You gotta say I again. Uh, I'm sorry. There you go. That's all right. Ash, put that head back on. You you know what? Ash, you need this head on. Even after I check your mouth, right. you can have your lollipop. Yeah, okay. You're okay. You're okay. 
Mm -hmm. Oh, you gave Mama a kiss. High five and do the next little two. Oh. I love you. Mm -hmm. All right, sit all the way back. Put your shoe on, ma'am. Look at me. Don't take that hand off. You hear me, ma'am. Mm -hmm.